think about how you would kill a glyptodont, like one of those giant armadillos that was built like a tank. It's the kind of stuff I think about. And it turns out, according to some new research, the strategy used by ancient people in South America was to hit them over the head and then flip them over. That seems unexpected to me. Glyptodonts, you recall, were big, slow, heavily armored herbivores. They went extinct like 11,000 years ago. And in 2022, researchers claimed that they had found evidence of how they were hunted by people. See, there are these glyptodont skulls from a site in Venezuela that's like maybe 16,000 years old. And it's the site of some of the oldest archeological evidence of human activity in South America. And this place turned up some strange patterns. Four skulls had fractures at the same spot, right at the top of the skull where the armor is thinnest. And it seemed like these blows were inflicted while the animals were alive. So the experts proposed that this was evidence of humans whacking them on the head to stun them. What does a stunned glyptodont look like? Again, I think about these things. That would have bought them enough time to finish them off and then flip them over to access their unarmored, meaty undersides. Keep thinking about that.